Hello guys, welcome to Memo Productions today. We are making a Mario Games tier list since um, we got 35 views in our first tier list video. Oh. Oh. The Oreo. Oh, nice. So we had 35 whole views in our first tier list video. Woo! So uh, if you want to see that, it's in my uh, channel page right now. You can go watch it. Be sure to like and um, subscribe. Yeah, make sure you like and subscribe and um, turn on those post notifications so you won't miss any of our tier list. And so we are making a Mario Games tier list. We are only counting the mainline games. No spin-offs, no racing games, no Mario Party. And um, yeah, there are some, the, 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 there are some spin-offs in here, but... We only count them as mainline games because they're kind of part of the lore and stuff. So, so let's get to the first Mario game that's from the NES. First Mario, Super Mario, or just regular Mario? Yeah, there's like a, the first Mario, uh, yeah. 1985. Uh, I'm gonna have to give that a between an A and an S tier because I mean that's just the classic. I mean that's what started it all right there. That's what made Mario a tradition to continue on with sequels and, and other games such as Mario Racing, Mario Party, etc. Without, without Mario, we have nothing. Yeah, we had nothing. Um, except, um, except, except um, video games wouldn't exist without Mario or Nintendo themselves. So, so I can put the Super Mario Bros. at the A tier. At, uh, it still has some... It still has some flaws, but I can put an A tier. All right, next in our list is um, Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. Ooh. Yoshi's Island, the original Yoshi's Island for the Super NES. For the Super NES. Um, Super NES, Super Mario Bros. Is that the one? Which one? Um, oh, Mar uh, Yoshi's Land? Yeah, Yoshi's Island. Um, it's kind of like the sequel to Mario World, but it's more like a prequel to the whole series. I want to give it like a B tier. I mean, Yoshi is a huge character. Like Yoshi's like my. Favorite I say it's Mario better than Super Mario Bros. You do? Yeah, See, I, I say I, it's better than Super one. Mario Bros. Um, I, when I played the Super NES, I I never really finished the game, but I still I think I had more um more gimmicks and more of a um more of a good um graphics than the eight bit one. Um, Yoshi was a good playable character. It had some unique gimmicks. Um, with the whole um, Yoshi's Island kind of theme. So I'm gonna put it at the top of A tier. It's not like S tier material, but A tier. We can, we can, um, at least give it some credit. At least the bosses are kind of better than the original. You know, you know, you got like giant piranha plant. Um, a giant baby Bowser. It's one of my favorites. Okay. And then next, it's probably gonna be like an S tier. Mario sixty four. Oh, that's an S tier all day. The graphics when that game came out was so ahead of its time. It was just like, I, I that's a game I probably played from when I was like seven to nine, day in and day out for like two years straight. Yeah. That was back when they used to release games every like four or five years instead of like every year. Yeah. Mario 64 is automatically S tier because of its great boss battles and great ga um, open zone uh, um, open world gameplay. That's it's a game that I played back when COVID came. As an adult, I played again just because like I needed something to do, and that was a game I was like, yeah. it was just so nostalgic. That's why I'm uh, um, I'm excited to get the N64. Because of all the uh, um, all the um, kind of games they have, like Donkey Kong sixty four. Oh. oh God, that's a great one. That's a great one. Um, maybe like um, Star Fox. Star Fox. Maybe um, maybe like Perfect Dark or something like that. Yep, the Legend of Zelda. Yep, 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 yep. All going at a time. Um, all right. So that's a, that's obviously S tier. Um. Um, we got, um, this is for the Game Boy Color, Super Mario Bros. Uh, Deluxe. Super Mario, so that's one I have. It's like the remake. 
it's like a remake of the um first um uh, Mario Bros. Except on the 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 more of a color palette. I honestly honestly it's kind of like a worse version. So when since it, it's um uh, it, since it has like game crunch, and um. The screen's so small, I can barely even see it. See, that's the thing. Is like, yeah. things, games like that on smaller screens, they take away from, like, just... Especially remakes. If you have a remake and you have it on a TV and then you, you downsize it to, like, a smaller screen, it just takes away so much. Yeah. It it. That's why I put it on emulator. Yeah. I'm going to put it at the C tier. Okay. That works for me. But, but they do it as some bonus content. So just to put it top C tier. Next is Mario Sunshine. Um, it's a bit mixed, in my opinion. Um, so it's not as good as Mario 64. Right. But the graphics are very enhanced. It's definitely. Yeah, for 2002. So, so, Mario Sunshine, uh, it's kind of a, sometimes it's mostly like a mixed bag, but like a, it's not really a perfect, um, 3D Mario game to go back to. Right. So maybe like a, a B tier? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I say put like a B tier. Um, cause um, Mario Sunshine. When I first played it, it was uh, I played it in uh through the All Stars. When that came out, yeah, during COVID, I played the first time. The gimmick was great, but the um, is it that the game just lacked the open world that it had. Yeah, see, I got it from my Switch, so I never owned it when it was on GameCube, so it feels yeah. weird playing it on the Switch with only so many buttons to press. Yeah. And there's, like, a lot, like, you have to crank his water up to fill his water. Yeah. At least the bosses are all, like, a bit better, since they use, like, the water gimmick yeah. as, like, a, a bit, um, an excuse to um, use it during battles. Like, um, it's the first, uh, I like how it's the first appearance of uh, P, um, P Piranha. Yes. That was a good boss. Um, he he battled him twice, and then, then we have Super Mario Advanced. Um, this is the um version of of Super Mario Bros. Two, from the I uh, um the U S version. U S version of Super Mario Bros. Yeah, yeah, like um, yeah, the. Are we talking NES? Or is it on one of um, other? It's on uh, Game Boy Advance. Um, um, it was the same game as the NES um, for the sequel. But, like, uh, it's really different. has a different gameplay style. Uh, I'd have to rank it lower than the original, especially because it's on an Advance. So the screen, again, is, is shrunken compared to a TV. But the positive is you get your graphics enhanced yeah. by quite a lot. Yeah. Yeah, some of the games are like um 32 bit, so like that's kind of a more it's, it's more like a 16 bit game than yeah. it's um original. So I put the B tier. So okay. works next me. is Super Mario World, aka Super Mario Advance 2. It's like a remake of um all the classics of the Advance games, the Advance Mario Advance games. This should have come up with the original. So putting ports everywhere, but I think Super Mario World is the my second favorite out of all the remakes. Super makes they made. If they made. Uh, so I'm going to put it at the A tier. A? The top of the A tier. Okay. I've never Next played. is Advanced 3, which is Yoshi's Island. Ooh. And I think it's a bit better. So I'm, I'm still going to put it at the A tier. A? Okay. Yeah. This is, it's just a little poor. Um, doesn't really change anything much besides the graphics and enhanced the, graphics always help. Yeah. It can only help the score. Yeah. They're making a Donkey Kong um Country Returns H D remake for next year. Oh really? So yeah. Yeah. Have to look out for that one. Alright, next is the last event, uh event for Super Mario Bros. three. I think, I think this is the best port out of all of them. Yeah, because isn't that the one where he gets his little, like, uh, his cat outfit where he can fly with his tail spinning in the air? Yeah. Isn't that the one? Yeah. Well, um, the Tanuki suit. Yes. yes. The first parents of the Tanuki suit. The power-ups in this game are way better than World than all the other classic games. So I had to put it at the S tier. Yes. yes. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm also going to put the original, if I can find the original. 
sendiri. My two at the A tier and some of my brothers three at the S tier. Is that Brian going on his third lap, I think? Yeah, he's in a lap this time. Yeah. They move a lot faster in the classroom when they're like... Then, uh, then, 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 uh, I put the original... they move like snails. Then, uh, I put the original Super Mario Bros. Um, I mean, uh, Super Mario World at the S tier. Okay. Um... Yeah, we weren't getting the classics before. Um, do you have the Game Boy? The Game Boy, um, younger. The game. Because it, um, the next game is Super Mario Land. And, um, this was kind of a fun game. I say it's, um, not as good as the original. Uh, Mario Bros. Yeah, I don't think but I owned uh, that one. But it, it was kind of a cool, um, rendition. At the original, um, it's kind of like you save Daisy for the first time, her first appearance. Ah, is that where? Because I play the uh, Super Mario Party time to time um, with my family, and outside of Princess Peach, I don't know who all these new characters are. There's like a Daisy, and then there's the other girl. That's. Do you know who I'm talking about? There's what? A third one, right? There's there's Princess Peach, there's Daisy, and then there's another girl. She kind of looks like one of the Frozen characters, I feel like. Rosalina? Yes. Rosalina from the Galaxy games? Yes, yes. She's in one of those uh, Mario parties that I have. Yeah, I say Super Mario Land goes to B tier. Uh, Super Mario Land 2, six golden coins. And uh, I think this is way better than the original. Because it has like a well, it's all that time of theme that they try to do. Um, when the game wave um, first came out. Okay. Also, also, also on a game of color. Um, I say it put it on top of uh, A tier. And so uh, it has some very great graphics in the first one 16 bit. Um, very good uh, rendition. Okay. I've never played that one, so I'm going to take your word for it. Uh, that one. Uh, through the All Stars, I got to put it at the bottom of S tier. It's just a. Um, we're gonna talk about the games, anyways. Um, Super Mario Bros. Thirty Five. What? Thirty Five? Yeah, uh, it was his thirty fifth anniversary, oh, okay. and then uh, they made like a little battle royale game. Yeah, I've never played it. Have you? You had me so thrown off. It was there. very like, good, but they canceled 35? it. Oh. They took it off the eShop. So it was like on, but you only had to like buy it. You could only buy it digitally. Yeah, yeah, because it's more like a battle way out game. And, and I don't, don't play it anymore because I took it down. That's unfortunate. Yeah, because they didn't look really uh, do well. Ah, so they're probably losing money. I, I, I still had to put it in the top of, um, in, the, in the middle of the A tier. Um, let's see, let's do um, Mario All Stars, the original All Stars. Hmm. Oh, stars for the SNES. You, you know, you could play uh, um, one. the other um, classic games. Yeah. So I kind of have to put it at the S tier. S tier. Yeah, I was gonna say like that one sounds. Yeah. Good. Yeah, you can put all the games and and I'm and, uh, 16 bit. It's pretty good. I need to learn these bits. What is 16 bit? 32 bit? What's like? Um, 16 bit like is the graphics ah, okay. for the games, but like the hands graphics sometimes the. Yeah. So 32, I'm assuming, is the better of the two, or 16? Um, okay, um, next, we got Super Mario 64 DS. The DS version. You get, you get to play Yoshi, Wario, Lu Lu Luigi, and then, then Mario. Mm -hmm. I say, I say it's kind of, uh, um, not, not as good as 64 as the original. That's wild, I never knew that. So those characters are playable on the on a different version? Yeah. Yeah, it came out in two thousand four, um, when the DS came out. Mm. Ah, I've never owned a Nintendo DS, so that's why yeah. I never heard. Thank God I didn't like this very much as the original. They kinda like they kinda ruined the whole classic. They kinda ruined the whole classic. Yeah. So I say put it in B tier. Okay, yeah, because the other one... Next, next is New Super Mario Bros. 
uh, DS. This is a classic, uh, classic, uh, well, DS version of uh, Super Mario Bros. And, um, takes it to a different plot. Uh, it's the first, it's the second appearance of, um, Bowser Jr., which is one of my favorites, um, uh, villains in the series. I which is one. with him in Mario Party when I play with my kids. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I usually play Bowser Jr. in, in uh, Mario Kart. <laughs> Mario Kart, because I always just love this character. And um, Super Mario Bros., uh, the first one of the DS, has to go to S tier. S tier? S some. Yeah, that sounds about right. The game is. Uh, yeah! You fool, that's a whole mile. Yeah. You, you'll probably be able to by the time we. This is Mario Bros. is a great game. You can play as um, Luigi with a cheat code, and then uh, and then uh, you get to play as Luigi. Oh, I really like, wait, what can you I do? really like that. You just press the two shoulder buttons together, and then um, then uh, press eight hold. Uh, uh, you press to hold those two shoulder buttons, and then um, and then press A. And then uh, you hold it until you get to the gameplay of, of the game, and then uh, you get to play as uh, Mario and Luigi. That's cool. And what Mario is this? Um, and this is some Mario Bros for the DS. All right, so the next Mario's. Oh, uh, yeah, yep. Yeah. Next is another S tier, Super Mario Galaxy. Ooh, that's a great one. Yeah, that one I'd have to give an S or an A. A tier, S tier. It's obviously an S since yeah. uh, it's one of the better Mario games of the decade. So I've only got to play it once since I've owned it. Cause... It came out in 2007 uh, yeah. after a year of the um, Wii's release. Decided to make a Mario, mainline Mario game. So a lot of people have told me that that one's more like similar to Super Mario 64, except it's more like a space theme. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's more like a space theme, but way better. So do you collect stars? Like, a, like you get the Yeah, you collect stars. Yeah, you collect stars. How many of them do you get? Is um, I only, like, uh, I think you get, like, less than, than, on, than the original game. Yeah. But I'm sure it's more challenging. Yeah, it's, play yeah, it's, yeah, it's very more challenging, but you, you also get to play as um, Luigi. So, you know, I put I like super, super, I put some I put some of my galaxy at the top of S tier. The top of S tier. Okay. Yeah, works for me. Next is uh uh Super Mario Bros. The Lost Levels. Super Mario Bros. The Lost Levels. This is automatically garbage tier. It's a sequel to the um original Mario Bros. But uh in Japan they couldn't um. Well, at least on, on, on US, they think it was a uh, really too challenging of a game, and uh, they're right. Um, Hold on, what are you thinking? One more, or are you done? You've done three. Would you like to do one more, or do you want to wrap it up? These guys are just going to finish going around. Let's do um, one more. Let's just break all the Mario games. Okay. We're doing this one. That way we can make an official one. One more lap, lap. yeah. Me. Yeah. Yeah, this game is F tier because it kind of ruined what made the game good, and um, put them to a lot of uh, a lot of dog poo. And uh, yes, you get the um, it uh, it's only hated because it's very challenging, and very long, and um, no other, uh, a lot of people hate this game. It says Super Mario Bros. Second, so. Put it, in F, put it in F tier. F next, next is <laughs> next is New Super Mario Bros. Wii. I've never played it. I've never played it. It's from 2009, yeah. and um, we might yeah, but I, I, I think it's like the best in the series, has ever. It's a very good game. Um, it, it has like a better story, better uh, character, um, level design. Get the development, all that stuff. So, got to put it at the top of the bomb and mess here. <laughs> Not in the DS original, though. Um, okay, next is Super Mario Galaxy 2. I didn't even know they came out with a sequel. <laughs> they did. 
I'm totally unaware. They did, but it's not really been in the first one. Okay. I say. Okay. Um, I, probably. I see like a, the um, bottom S tier. Okay. Oh, so it is good. It's just not like a, as great as the first one. Yeah. It's like really good. Yeah. It's just good. Yeah. Gotcha. Um. And now next is Super Mario 3D Land. And now this is like a very great, um, good for two thousand for, for for the 3DS when it came out. What does it look like? Um, Super Mario 3D Land. Yeah, like the. You logo. played that before for the 3DS. I want to say I have. I've heard of that. Super Mario 3D Land. It's a very great game, but it's not really uh, S tier, so. So I'll put it at the top of A tier. Okay. Yeah, I think I bought one of those for my son a couple Christmas ago because it was like on sale for cheaper than what it usually is. Yeah. Alright, next is New Super Mario Bros. 2. I, I say it's not better than the original. Super Mario Bros. 2. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the original you can't. Yeah, but it's still like uh, S tier though. Um, it's still S tier though. It's, it's, it's at the very bottom, but at least that, at, at least they bring the, like the Koopa Lanes back from the Wii version. Is that the Koopa Troopas? Is that what yeah. called? No, uh, no, the uh, Koopa Lanes. Oh, is that the one with the wings? No, like, no, like the Koopa Lanes, like the um, like uh, Ludwig, Roy. My, uh, Larry, um, yeah, I'll show you uh, afterwards, but the back and from Mario 3, so. Did you beat any of the, um, Mario 3 games bosses from Mario 3? What's that? Did you beat, did, did you beat, like, uh, any, um, any of the bosses from Mario 3? Mm, it's been so long. I want to say yeah, like one of the, like, one of the few bosses. I never really got too far with those because I was so young trying to play them and beat them. Yeah. Like the um, NES version you're talking about. Yeah, the NES version. Yeah. No, I never yeah. got too far with those. Love all those right, games. all right. Next is New Super Mario Bros. U. Super Mario Bros. U. Yeah. Also the the art uh, deluxe version. Did Super Mario Bros. go to college or something? University? Super Mario Bros. U. Super Mario Bros. U. Universe. Uh, no, I've never no, played um, it. No, uh, it's for the Wii U. Uh, yeah, I've never played that one. Is it good? I, I, I put the deluxe version. It's really good. It's just not as better as the... Uh, it's better than the Wii, because I never really played the Wii U. Uh, but I, I assume it's an S tier, so... You have a near New Super Mario Bros. DS version. Next is Super Mario, um, um, I'm sorry, New Super, Super Luigi U. Super Luigi? Yeah. I like Luigi a lot. It came out at the, on the year of Luigi, when they're, um, making Luigi-based content, like, um, Luigi's Mansion, Dark Moon, uh, this game, but it came out like a massive failure, but, um, it's a, it's kind of like a hard mode version of the, um, of the original game, but I say it's like way better. To put a top of S tier. Alright, we're just gonna wait for Brian. Next is Super Mario 3D World. Super Mario 3D World? Yeah, for the Wii U. And for the Switch, since, you know, they came out with a remake. What do you think? No, don't go. Hey guys, come on over this way, because we're gonna be going back in. We're just waiting on Brian. I don't want Will you stop, Michael? We're going back in. I know. The incessant, like, whining. I know. Next is the Super Mario 3D World. And, um, it's been, it's way, it's way better than the 3D, uh, land, and, and now all the my games were ranked. So I'm gonna put this in top of S tier, no questions asked. They have very good, very good pilots like the Double Cherry and the Cat Suit. The bosses were very unique. I kind of feel like. And um, next, um, you may may or may not play this game, but it's um Mario Maker for the Wii U and 3DS. Mario Maker. Mario Maker. Mario Maker is uh, S tier. Mario Maker, you get to make uh, create levels of different variants of the games. 
Hmm. You get to create your own Mario levels. Your own Mario levels? That's cool. Yeah. You can't... Yeah. Yeah. Like uh, you can make like uh, you can make like Mario three levels. Um, Mario uh, U levels. Oh, that's so cool! So you can like the original, yeah, like so Mario game. World, and then um, then um, and then the sequel is also getting a top of S tier. I would so have to get then top since of since um, you can you go to three D World and then um, make your own two D levels for the for for uh three D World. Yeah, I would have to give that that. How can that not be top tier if you can do all sorts of like levels that you want to do? Yeah. Incorporate Next. Next is Super Mario Run. Super Mario Run. D tier. Never played that yet. Yeah. D tier. It's just not a good mobile Mario game as um Mario Kart oh, Tour or something like that. They barely even make um, mobile games besides Pokemon. Oh, so they like got Pokemon creators trying to make a Mario game? Yeah. That sounds terrible. They should stick to what they do best and the Mario people should stick to Mario. Yeah. Yep. Yep. I agree. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. I know. I'm trying to walk the plank here, and I almost tipped off the sidewalk. All right. Next is Super Mario Odyssey. Super Mario Odyssey. That's a good one. That has to be S here. Yeah, I've heard that's a big one. That has to be S here. It's gonna make me spend like three hundred dollars buying Nintendo Switch games of Mario. I definitely want to try the Super Mario Odyssey. Honestly, I guess it is the best video Mario game I've ever played. But, but like um I see I say it's like the best game on Switch. Since um you you have, you have the Cappy gimmick. Um, you can do so many, uh, you, you uh, cut moons instead of stars. And what's the one for the Switch where there's Super Mario Brothers, but they like, I'm trying to think of what they do. They do, it's a certain, because that's another game I have. Oh, I can't think of it. Oh. It's like, it's Mario, Super Mario Bros, but it's got like an extended name to it. They do something specific. Oh. Oh, um. The mean uh, deluxe? The mean deluxe? I think it's deluxe. Really ranked it, but um, there's another game I think you actually have. Um, all right, next is Bowser's Fury. That's gonna be a good one, right? Bowser's Fury is this undeniably S tier. Yeah. It's a very great uh, um uh, DLC extra content since they make Bowser like Godzilla, and you have to um get these uh, little cat shines. Like, it's kind of similar to Mario Sunshine, in a way. Yeah. Like, it's it's like an open world, kind of, um, 3D world. Yeah, so uh, it's, it, it's like mostly cat-themed. Uh, Mario turns to this giant-looking giga cat ma uh, Mario. Like in the movie? Yep. <laughs> yep, and uh, beats the crap out of Bowser. Honestly, honestly, honestly like, the best part is the Mario fight. Um... Come on! The best part. Sorry, bro. Um, <laughs> no, you're right there. Also, also, you get to play as Bell, which um, you have to help his dad um, get, stop getting corrupted, and um, it's really his fault for the whole thing. That's and cool. and the last Mario game we have to talk about is Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Hmm. Mario Wonder. That might be it. It's just a game you have. What does it look like? Um, Mario Wonder. No, that's actually not, so it must Deluxe is the one I have. I think it is Deluxe, too. Yeah, uh, um, Mario Wonder is a very, uh, great, but also, um, um, i say it's not better than the, than the new game, since the bosses are kind of weird, and the, um, and they... This um um the level design can be kind of weird sometimes, but it, like it felt like they ran out of um ideas, so it just so does they just combine the things together, make it to one big level, and not a huge fan of it, but I say it's in, in gameplay, it's like the best in the series. For the in 
gameplay. Yeah, yeah. I say it's better than New Super Mario Bros. games. So Besides bad. the bosses being a little too easy. But yeah. the but the final bosses mix up for it. So I kind of put it in uh, S tier. And that is all the oh. Mario games. S tier? Alright. Yep. Yeah. Yep, that's all the Mario games. Where's the best? Where's the first? That was awesome. You did a good one there. Yep. Yeah, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This was like 10, 10 extra minutes long. This is 30 minutes long, so. So thank you for the tier list. So. We are done with the tier list, so. Make sure uh, you comment an um, another tier list we should do. And that's about it. See you guys later.